Hi, I'm Jamie Hartling from Leathersmith Designs. I'm going to show you how to do this decorative three lace braid. To do the three lace braid, you need two rows of holes running down the length of the leather ending with three holes and starting with three holes. To start my three lace braid I take each of the laces and put them through the back of the leather through the three holes. On the front side I take my lace on the far left, go under my middle lace, over my lace on the far right. I don't go through the next hole, I skip a hole and go through this hole here. The middle lace, I don't go through the hole directly below. I skip a hole and go to this hole here. So you can see the pattern starting. Now I'm going to flip it over. I'm going to hold down two laces in the middle, flip this over, and what's going to happen is I'm going to take one lace, I'm going to go on top of this lace and through the hole directly above it. And you can see what happened is these two laces are being held under this lace which is being held under that lace. I take my lace on the other side and go to the hole directly above it, pull it down, and now I'm ready to start my pattern, which is slightly different than the way we started. The lace method goes like this. You take your first lace on the far left and go over the lace next to it, under the middle lace, and over the last lace. And then you take it and go through your hole on the far right. And as you pull it through, make sure you don't get any twists in it. If you want it to lay flat. Then you take your lace on the far left and go through the hole on the far left. Again, pulling it through so you don't get any twists. Now you flip the leather over and you take your lace and go through the hole directly above it. pull it snug and you take your next lace, do the same thing. Go through the hole directly above it, pull it through, and you flip it over and you reach back to the start of your pattern. This is a little closer shot. Your lace on the far left goes over the lace next to it. It then goes under the middle lace and over the last lace on the far right and you can see how it lines up directly with the hole on the far right and you can see how the lace on the far left is aiming to go in through that hole on the far left. To end the lace pattern is easy. You continue with the same pattern. You go over your first lace, under your middle lace, and over your last lace, through the hole,
or snug. Take your lace on the far left. Go through your last hole on the left. Now you're to the end of the holes, except you had this middle lace hanging free. And that's what that middle hole is for at the end and at the beginning. You take that middle lace, go through that last hole. So now all the laces are through the front of the leather. We flip it over and to tie it off, you take two laces, put them down flat, take your remaining lace, go over these two and just through one of your loops. Pull it snug. And then you can clip off the ends and you can finish it off if you want to cover it with a lining leather. It'll look very nice.